there, Bixby Beavers. It's Mr. Vieira. Happy Monday. I missed you last week. I didn't have a video for you, and I'm sorry about that. I love doing videos for you, and last week I just couldn't do it. I'm so sorry. I just ran out of time, and but here I am. I'm here this week, and want to continue to encourage you as you um, we enter into another week of testing, um, and we don't have very much testing to do uh, that's left, so um, I want you to feel good about that. Um, I also want you to think about, as you are do taking your test, I still want you to do your best, right? It's I know it's awfully challenging to have to think of like, oh my gosh, another week of testing, but I'm going to tell you something. Um, so I want you to know that when you complete one of those tests it helps us as a school decide what we can do so that we can teach everyone the best we can teach right so it kind of gives us information about how we're teaching and we want to make sure that we're teaching you well okay and so so please do your best so that we know where we really need to grow and um, and we also want to see where you glow. Got it? So if you, whenever you take a test, I think I want you to think about that. It helps your teachers know where you grow and where you glow. Well, thank you for doing that. And I'm grateful that you're all being uh, very supportive of one another. You're not being disruptive in class. And you're doing your best. And I'm proud of you for that. Um, so... Um, I have, uh, uh, we have about five more Fridays left. Can you believe it? And then summer begins. So we're going we're gonna to work really hard on doing our best and uh, finishing off our year strong. And I know that you're capable of doing that because I see the work that you do every day. All right? See you later. Hey there, Bixby Beavers, it's Bragtag Bruno here. Yeah, I know, I haven't been around for a couple weeks, so I'm sorry I missed you. But anyway, hey, want to say thank you on behalf of the teachers for all the notes and flowers and very generous gifts that you brought to them for Teachers Appreciation Week last week. Mr. Vieira himself told me he was really... Uh, just touched by how uh, how generous you are to your teachers, which is great because they do a lot of good things for you, don't they? Yeah. Well, anyway, hey, I don't know if there's anybody prouder here than uh, me, maybe Mr. Vieira, maybe your teachers, but proud for, for you for the way that you've been working hard all these weeks. And I know that you only have a couple more weeks left of school, more like five weeks, I guess. But we're coming down to the final weeks of school, and you still need to be the best beaver you can be. You got that? What I mean by that is that when you're eating lunch, you're throwing your trash away, making sure that we're taking care of our campus. We don't leave trash on the floor or on the tables. That's not okay. A real Bixby Beaver doesn't do that. The other thing I need to make sure that you're doing is making sure that you're keeping your sweatshirts and jackets off the blacktop. That's right. Don't leave them on the ground, on the playground. You either tie them around your waist or leave them in your class or keep them on. But don't put them on the floor. If you do, you're going to owe Miss Jackson some time. I said that. The other thing I want you to think about is the noise level in the cafeteria. That's right. When you're lining up, you got to line up quietly so that when you go inside that cafeteria, you're not as noisy and loud. You see, when you're too noisy and too loud, the workers in there can't hear the radio in the case of an emergency or maybe someone's getting called to go home. So you make sure that you keep that noise level low. That's, we're going to be giving brag tags to the quietest tables in the cafeteria. Got it? Good. 
Well, got a lot of good prizes waiting for you for Friday when Bragtag Bruno calls, calls some names. So, do your best. Make sure that you're inclusive, be respectful, and take care of this campus. Because this is your campus, and it's mine too. And I don't like seeing a messy, dirty campus, and a campus with unfriendly kids or disrespectful kids. And I know that Bigsby doesn't have any of those, but every once in a while you need to be reminded. All right, so let's have ourselves a great week. You got it? Good. Do it!